Hi, I am Stefan Ukransky and welcome to Let's Talk Sports. Today we will cover the Philly Wings flying in New York, Flyers winning in Pittsburgh, Jake Elliott being named NFC Special Teams Player of the Week, Deshaun Jackson's retirement, and lastly I will make my picks for Week 14 of the NFL season. The new season started brilliantly for the Philadelphia Wings on Saturday night as they sprinted out to a 5-0 lead over the New York Riptide and held on for a 13-10 victory in the season opening contest for both teams. Several members of the Wings offense picked up right where they left off last season, with new captain Blaze Wadorian scoring four goals to lead the way while Mitch Jones added two goals and contributed six assists for an eight-point game his 11th game of 6 points or more as a Wayne in 13 games with the club. Joe Wetzatarius assisted on 5 of the goals, while holding Katoni picked up a pair in his first game with the Wings. On the defensive side, Zach Higgins was the team's player of the game with 48 saves on 58 whip tied opportunities. Mike McCann had a pair of points in his Wayne's debut, and Scott Dominey picked up 5 loose balls in his. Mitch Armstrong and Jackson Ganton made their NLL debuts on the back end. Final score, Wings 13, with tie 10. Good luck to the Philadelphia Wings in their next game against the Toronto Walk on Saturday. The Philadelphia Flyers defeated the Pittsburgh Penguins by a shootout 4-3 at PPG Paints Arena on Saturday evening. Philly rallied back from deficits of 1-0 in the second period and 2-1 in the third. The Flyers were unable to close the game out in regulation. They had to kill a 4-on-3 Pittsburgh power play in the final minute of overtime in order to get the match to a shootout. Winning goaltender Samuel Ellison took care of the West with some help from Sean Couturier. Ellison stopped 29 of 32 shots in regulation and overtime and then all three he faced in the shootout. Final score, Flyers 4, Penguins 3. Good luck to the Philadelphia Flyers in their next game against the Arizona Coyotes on Thursday. Eagles kicker Jake Elliott has been named NFC Special Teams Player of the Week after another clutch performance in a 37-34 overtime win against the Buffalo Bills in Week 12. Elliott made all four of his extra points and a huge 59-yard field goal that sent the game to overtime en route to his third NFC Special Teams Player of the Week honor of the season. He is now 4-for-4 four four from 58-plus yards in his career and 8 for eight with under two minutes left in regulation or in overtime to tie or give Philadelphia the lead. Congratulations to Jake Elliott for being named NFC Special Teams Player of the Week. Former Pro Bowl wide receiver Deshaun Jackson is retiring as a member of the Philadelphia Eagles. Jackson played 8 of his 15 NFL seasons with the Eagles, earning all 3 of his Pro Bowl nods with Philadelphia. He was a game breaker as a receiver and returner, leading the league in yards per reception 4 times. On December 19, 2010, the Eagles overcame a 31-10 fourth quarter deficit against the rival Giants. New York punted with 12 seconds left, and Jackson returned it 65 yards for a touchdown as time expired. The game came to be known as the Miracle at the New Meadowlands. Jackson also played for Washington, Tampa Bay, Baltimore, Las Vegas, and the Los Angeles Rams. He appeared in seven regular season games for LA in 2021, and although he wasn't with the team in the playoffs, he still earned a Super Bowl win. Let's wish Deshaun Jackson the best of luck in his retirement. I went 1-5 in, in my picks. A huge disappointment over last week. I only got the Dolphins right. I missed the Seahawks, Saints, sadly the Eagles, Browns, and Chiefs. Hopefully I can do better this week. It's week 14 of the NFL season. Which teams will win on Thursday and Sunday? New England Patriots versus Pittsburgh Steelers. The Patriots lost 6 to nothing to the Chargers. The Steelers lost 24 to 10 to Arizona. I have the Steelers winning in Pittsburgh. 
Detroit Lions vs. Chicago Bears and NFC North Showdown. The Lions won 33-28 at New Orleans. The Bears are coming off their bye week. I have the Lions winning in Chicago. Los Angeles Rams vs. Baltimore Ravens. The Rams won 36-19 to Cleveland. The Ravens are coming off their bye week. I have the Ravens winning in Baltimore. Minnesota Vikings vs. Las Vegas Raiders. The Vikings and Raiders are coming off their bye weeks. I have the Raiders winning in Vegas. Buffalo Bills vs. Kansas City Chiefs. The Bills are coming off their bye week. The Chiefs lost 27-19 at Green Bay. I have the Chiefs winning in Kansas City. Philadelphia Eagles vs. Dallas Cowboys. A battle of the NFC East. The Cowboys won 41-35 to Seattle. The Eagles lost big 42-19 to San Francisco. Sorry Cowboys fans! The Eagles are going to take the W, and it hurts so good! Check in next week, and we will see how everyone did. Which NFL team's name was inspired by a famous writer? The answer, Baltimore Ravens. Named after the famous writer, Edgar Allan Poe. That is a wrap. You can check me out on my podcast at Stefano Sports Radio, or through the podcast app, or this YouTube channel. And you can listen to me on Saturday nights at 6 o'clock on 1360 WNJC, found on most streaming services. Thank you for watching, and see you next time on Let's Talk Sports.